We start the face making a slip knot and chain 5. On the chain number 4 we make a single crochet, continue with 2 single crochet, Three single crochet on the chain of the corner continue on the other side of the chain two single crochet and two single crochet on the last chain Continue with one increase, we make one single crochet, place the stitch marker, one single crochet on the same space making the increase, two single crochet, three increases, Two single crochet again and finish this row with two increases. Continue with one single crochet. On the next space we are going to make one half double crochet, one double crochet, two half double crochet. We have four stitches on the same space. Continue on the next stitch with one single crochet. Continue with one slip stitch, one single crochet, now in the same space we make two half double crochet, one double crochet, one half double crochet. We have the same, the same four stitches that we have on the other side and continue with one single crochet to the end of the row. And on the row number 4 we are going to make one single crochet on each stitch, one single crochet on each stitch And once we finish this row, we have to cut the yarn, leaving a long end for sewing. We start the body from the head, making a 6 single crochet magic ring. We make the magic ring and make 6 single crochet in the magic ring. We close the magic ring, pulling the yarn and on the row number 2 we are going to make one increase around 
Remember, one increases two single crochet in the same space. We make six increases in this round, finishing with 12 stitches. On the row number 3, we have to make one single crochet and one increase. Repeating around, one single crochet and one increase to have 18 stitches. On the row number 4, we are going to make 2 single crochet and 1 increase. Two single crochet and 1 increase, repeating around to have 24 stitches. On the row number 5, we make 3 single crochet and 1 increase, repeating around 3 single crochet and 1 increase to have 30 stitches. On the row number 6, we are going to make 4 single crochet and 1 increase. repeating around 4 single crochet and 1 increase to have 36 stitches. From the row 7 to the row 12, we are going to make one single crochet around. We have 36 stitches, so we have to make from the row, from the round 7 to the round 12, one single crochet around. On the round number 13, we are going to make four single crochet and one decrease. We make 4 single crochet and remember how to make the decrease. We have to take the front part of the stitch of the two following stitches and make the single crochet. We have one decrease. And repeat 4 single crochet and 1 decrease to the end of the row finishing with 30 stitches. On the row number 14, we are going to make 3 single crochet and 1 decrease. 3 single crochet and 1 decrease, repeating around finishing with 24 stitches. On the row number 15, we are going to make two single crochet and one decrease. Two single crochet and one decrease, repeating around to have 18 stitches. On the row number 16, 
we make one single crochet and one decrease. Repeating around one single crochet and one decrease to have 12 stitches. On the row number 17, we make one single crochet and one increase. Repeating around one single crochet and one increase, finishing with 18 stitches. On the row number 18, we are going to make two single crochet and one increase. Repeating around two single crochet and one increase to the end of the row, finishing with 24 stitches. From the round 19 to the round 26, we are going to make one single crochet around. We have 24 stitches, so we have to make 24 stitches from the row, from the round 19 to the round 26. Now we are going to sew the face on the head. We take a needle and sew the face on the head. We place two safety eyes. Once we placed the safety eyes, now we have to stuff we have to stuff the head and the body be sure when when you sew the face that the middle of the face is in the same line of the beginning of the row because now we are going to separate the legs To separate the legs we have to count 12 stitches from the stitch marker, 12 stitches from the beginning of, it, of the row, and make one slip stitch on the stitch number 12. One slip a stitch, one slip a stitch on the stitch number 12. Now we are going to work the legs separate. We have we have to make now 12 single crochet on each row. We have to start with 12 single crochet on this on this leg. We make the first single crochet, place the marker and finish this row with 12 single crochet. Continue on the next two rows with 12 single crochet more, 12 single crochet on the next two rows. Remember, we are working only in one leg. Now we are going to make one row with six decreases, but taking the back part of the stitch, taking the back loop of the stitch, six decreases. Remember, taking the back loop. Once we finished the six decreases, we have to fasten off. Enough. 
and we are going to stuff the body and the first leg from this hole we are going to stuff the body and the leg once we finished the first leg we have to continue with the second leg we have to place the yarn in the center of the two legs and repeat the same that we made with the first leg we have to make three rows with 12 single crochet And once we finish the, the three rows of 12 stitches we have to repeat again the six decreases and we can stuff a little bit and fasten off to make the ears we are going to start with a six single crochet magic ring once we have the magic ring we have to start on the row number two we have to make six increases finishing with 12 stitches six increases finishing with 12 stitches on the row number three we are going to make one single crochet and one increase repeating around one single crochet and one increase finishing with 18 stitches Once we finished the row number three, we have to cut the yarn and leave a long end for sewing. We start the yarns making a six single crochet magic ring. On the row number two, we are going to make one single crochet and one increase, repeating around, finishing with nine stitches one single crochet and one increase, repeating around. From the row 3 to the row number 10 we are going to make one single crochet around one single crochet around from the row 3 to the row number 10 To make the banana we have to start also with a six single crochet magic ring. On the row number two we are going to make one single crochet and one increase, repeating around, finishing with nine single crochet. On the rows 3, 4 and 5 we are going to make one single crochet around, we are going to make 3 rows with 9 single crochet. We start the row number 6 with 2 increases two increases two single crochet two decreases
and finish with one single crochet. Making the increases in one side and the decreases of the other side, we, we get the shape of the banana. Continue with three more rows with one single crochet on each single crochet, three rows with nine single crochet, and finish the banana with one single crochet and one decrease, repeating around, and we can stuff and fasten off. Here you can see the banana finished. As I said before, you have increases in one side and decreases on the other side. And it takes this shape. We start the hat making a six single crochet magic ring. On the row number two, we are going to make one increase around one increase around, finishing with 12 stitches on the row number 3 we make one single crochet and one increase repeating around one single crochet and one increase to have 18 stitches On the row number 4 we are going to make one single crochet around but taking the back loop one single crochet around 18 single crochet taking the back loop of the stitch On the next three rows we are going to make also one single crochet on each single crochet but now taking both loops. Three rows with one single crochet on each single crochet. We can cut the yarn leaving a long tail for sewing. We have to stuff a little bit the hat and sew the hat in one side of the head. To make the tail we have to start with a 7 single crochet magic ring and we have to make one single crochet on each single crochet of the previous row from the rows 2 to the row 15. And once we finish the tail we have to sew all parts and we have the monkey finished.